Welcome to today's presentation. The question today is about Hooke's law. A force of 6 newtons extends a spring by 0 0.2 centimeters. Calculate the work done in extending this spring when a mass of 500 grams is hung on it, assuming its elastic limit is not exceeded. Now, this statement here simply means that the spring obeys Hooke's law. That is, assuming its elastic limit is not exceeded. So, the work done in stretching the spring is obtained as a half k e squared, where k is the spring constant and e is the extension. Now, before we apply this formula, we are going to determine the spring constant and extension as a result of the 500 grams mass. So, by Hooke's law, the spring constant is given by the stretching force over the extension. And here, the stretching force is 6 newtons. We are told it extends a spring by 0 0.2 centimeters. So the stretching force, 6 newtons, divided by the extension. So we have 0 0.2 centimeters. I'll convert it into meters. So dividing by 100, we have... 0 0.002 meters. So when you divide this, we get 3,000 newtons per meter. The next thing is to determine the extension by the mass 500 grams. Now again, by Hooke's law, extension is force over the spring constant. So force as a result of 500 grams is 5 newtons. Remember, 500 grams into kilograms is 0 0.5. We divide by 1,000 since 1,000 grams is 1 kilogram. So we'll have the force there as 0 0.5 times 10. Remember, 10 is the gravitational field strength. And then we divide it by the spring constant, which is 3000, and this should give us 1 over 600 meters. Now, given that we now know the spring constant and we also know the extension, we can now apply this formula here for work done. So we say work done is a half times the spring constant 3000 times the square of the extension 1 over 600 and that should give us 0 0.004167 joules and that is how we go about this question thank you for watching hope to see you in the next video bye